So hello everybody, how are you today? I have some exciting news. I am going to show you how to connect to a Power BI service model using DAX Studio. We've been able to do it with DAX, you know, Power BI desktop for, for years. Now we can do it with Power BI service. So all of that in just a second. Stay tuned. Okay, so are you excited? We will be able to connect to a model that leaves some Power BI service using DAX Studio. There is a but, and it's a big but. Well, there's two big buts. The first one is that it is only on premium capacity. So if you don't have Power BI Premium, you won't be able to use this trick. Sorry about that. And the second one is just read only for now. We'll see what it develops. But if you have premium capacity and you're interested in doing this, this is how you do it. So this is my premium capacity. I have here a demo workspace and in there I have a Power BI template for WordPress files. So this is a report that I created for another demo. So what we're going to do is we're going to connect to this model, to this data set using DAX Studio. So how do you do it? First of all, you need to have the latest and greatest DAX Studio. Okay, so go and download the latest one, otherwise it won't work. So when you go and download it and open it, you will be presented with a connect um, window. You go to tabular server and then you write this Power BI API, powerbi.com version one, my organization, and then you write the name of your workspace. So my organization it should be like that. And then the name of your workspace. And the name of your workspace is that one. Demos, in my case. So whatever workspace you want to connect to, you have to put it in there. So you go in there, click connect. I will put the, the URL down in the description box so you can just copy paste it, okay? And then you just log in. You have to obviously authenticate yourself. And it will take a little while before it actually makes all the connections and authentications and all that stuff. So if you don't see anything happening like you see here, don't worry. You see, now it is saying establishing a connection. So it actually authenticate and it's just connecting to the model. And as you can see, it loaded here. So we have a data table that was created automatically by Power BI and then a WordPress post table, which is exactly what I have in here. I just had one table for this demo data set. You can see here, nothing else. I need connected to it. So you need to have a Power BI capacity, which is a pity. Hopefully it will come from pro users at some point and it is read only for now. We'll see what Microsoft develops in the future. But either way, this is huge. So I hope you enjoy it. Just wanted to pop up and say that I'll see you again tomorrow as usual with a Power BI video. Okay. Bye. See you tomorrow.